Ladies, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, this is the web developer extraordinaire here coming at you with a public service announcement. You know, you go on YouTube and this is the kind of garbage that we see day in, day out. Anybody would have you think here that PHP is on the decline. Look at this. Why isn't functional programming the norm? It has over a million views. And just the other day, we had Traverse's web development guide, a video with a longer runtime than the Empire Strikes Back, and yet he dedicated a pathetic 79 seconds to PHP, most of which was him just reading from other websites. Well, the web developer extraordinaire is here to tell you the truth. PHP is not in the decline, or any kind of decline. Is it the decline or just decline? I think it's just decline. Whatever. Let me show you the truth, my friends. Here's the truth. PHP maintains an enormous leading server-side programming. Actually, that's not accurate because PHP is building the lead. Do you hear me? Check it out. The story is clear. I'm going to read. Now, this is a report coming in from w 3 Techs. They certainly know what they're talking about. Maybe I'll leave a link to this one in the description. In 2010, here are the facts. In 2010, PHP had a 72.5% share of server-side technologies. Today, PHP holds a 78.9% share of server-side technologies. If PHP was a search engine, its name would be Google. If PHP was a bank, it would be closed down by the government for having a monopoly. So you listen up and you listen good, ladies and gentlemen. This is not true. The stuff that you are watching on YouTube is not true. YouTube is pushing functional technologies and JavaScript based technologies with their algorithm and they are doing so so that they can sell you hosting packages like their Firebase package where you can upload sites that are not stateful and uh, during the live stream I explain the full technicalities of why they have to do that and just in case you missed it, if you happen to be the, in the business of running data centers across the world, then a technology like PHP is a thorn in the side because PHP is stateful. It uses sessions, it uses cookies and so on. They don't want that to happen. It's a massive inconvenience for the big tech companies, particularly Amazon, Google and Microsoft. This is why we have toilet paper like this being pushed. This is why your feed is filling up with utter garbage that would have you believe that PHP is on the decline and Ruby is already dead. Did I mention Ruby? Well, if you like Ruby, I have some good news. It says, among the small fry, the only truly impressive growth to be seen is in Ruby, which at 5.2% this month is still seeing continued uninterrupted growth. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. You may now submit your thumbs ups. Let's all submit a thumbs up and a comment. Why don't we? As if there is a hope of this channel ever doing well on YouTube.